Hey guys, and we're back. Um, I'm done taking a break. Um, it made enough of that long. I said I was gonna do it. Uh, come back when Amani Bates transfers. It's been the man taken forever. Uh, but we're gonna make some more videos now because after the NBA draft happened, um, maybe some free agency videos after when it starts. I think it starts June 30th. I'm not sure, but we're gonna talk about Max Christie today and what a horrible pick this was. I don't. If you think it's a good pick, I don't know. So if you not know, I'm a Laker fan. And it was a very bad pick. Um, so before the draft, Woj reported that the Lakers would be trading for the 35th pick in the second round of the 2022 NBA draft. And it was pretty exciting because we we're going to get a young talent. And I don't know if we're going to actually keep him. I Maybe he could be used in a sign-in trade for Kyrie Irving. I'm not sure. Um, but he's a he's not – he was a good player recruiting-wise. Like, when out of high school, he was a really good player. I remember seeing this guy, like, in his, like, first college game, he was re had a really good game. I'm like, this kid's going to be good. He wasn't good. He only had nine points this season. There were so many good guys on the draft board. And I thought some teams were making really bad picks. I was like, what are these teams doing? And then I looked at when we picked. I'm like, what are we doing? Bryce McGowan's was on the board. Um, Jaden Hardy, Kennedy Chandler, EJ Liddell, Trevor Keels, all those players could have been first-round picks. And there, EJ Liddell was on the board. Why didn't we take him? Dwight is old. Carmelo is old. Those guys are old. We need some younger guys. Jaden Hardy's a good player. Average like 19 points. Kennedy Chandler's good. Bryce McGowan's good. And like Trevor Keels is good. But I'll see you guys in the next video, guys. It was a pretty weird pick, but see you guys.